Our human computer interaction and design program, I think, is um, ideally positioned to make a big impact in the world right now because as more and more products and services come out that are consumer facing and uh, really involve the marriage between technology and people, uh, we have to get that design right. I think overall, the industry is maturing. So before in technology, if something worked, it was magical. Like, it's cool that it works. But now, like, people just have higher expectations of what will delight them, what will surprise them. The MHCID program is a cross-departmental, interdisciplinary program that is not owned by any one department. And the four departments that uh, contribute faculty, time, and resources to the program are the Information School, where I come from, the Department of Computer Science and Engineering, the Department of Human-Centered Design and Engineering, and the Division of Design within the School of Art. Coming in, I was totally surprised at the caliber of who was teaching our program. So there's at least two or three professors I know in the past two years that were under in the list of like 30 most innovative under 35. They're like the people who wrote the book on input, on ubiquitous computing, on um, persuasive design. Well, one of the nice things about this program is that it, I think, is more reflective of the workplace in the sense that we recruit people from a variety of different backgrounds and perspectives and we bring them together. It's a one-year program, uh, project-based. It's basically um, centered with a studio class and this studio class actually emphasizes on lots of hands-on work. Our curriculum is focused on three specific sections. So one, research, so learning about the psychology and how about people, how do you really understand and get at what people want and need, what their pain points are. And then from that, how do you ideate a cre or create a solution to meet those needs? And then prototyping a technology, learning how to actually execute on those types of ideas. The Capstone Project is an opportunity to take all of the tools and knowledge that students have learned through our core curriculum and their electives and apply it to a, more, a bit more intensive, lengthy project. The Capstone Project is a massive portfolio piece that gives them a chance to really show off something substantial to a future employer. We actually can provide a lot of hands-on career development support because we have a small cohort. Since coming to the program, I've had a ton of interviews with different design agencies, with technology companies, and I actually got a job as a user researcher at Amazon. Facebook and Google have, have taken some of the hires. We have others going out and doing um, program, uh, startups of their own and we have people working in nonprofits as well. So we're already starting to see a spread of opportunities that students are taking on. A huge advantage is Seattle is a fantastic technology industry community and user experience community. And so in fact, I think we are embedded in an incredibly dynamic global community that models exactly what we're teaching. For HCI and design, it really is, a, is maybe the nation's center of gravity.